Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. This is Chris. Hey, what's up, Chris? Hey. Uh, I've got a HP laptop, about three years old, that I have what believes to be a BIOS problem. Um, let me just tell you a little bit about what I have come up with. Um, first off, when you turn on the machine, it loads through the Windows XP boot screen, and then it just freezes. So obviously the first thing I did was put in the OS disk to uh, try and do like a system recovery, and it basically doesn't even get through the load-up screen where it's loading all the DLL files and, and all that kind of stuff. Um, and then I get an error that basically gives me an executable file name, letting me know it couldn't be loaded and giving me an error code. Um, after some research on the Internet, I've, I'm pretty sure it's a BIOS problem. Um, basically, I've wiped the hard drive. I've, well, deleted the partition, repartitioned, reformatted, reinstalled, or tried to reinstall XP, same thing. So, I mean, doesn't that pretty much eliminate everything software-based but the BIOS? Uh, yeah, and it could be a compatibility with the chipset. Uh, have you tried installing chipset drivers in Windows before installing um, anything else? After well, a reinstall? Well, unfortunately, I can't get into Windows. Even after a reinstall? It won't let me reinstall. That's the problem. Dude, it, wait. Uh, it gives me the exact same executable file name and tells me that it could not be loaded. Uh, I tried a, different, a different a, wait, wait, wait. disk. Wait, is that in a Windows setup or in the restore procedure that it was given to you? Um, it's actually in the Windows setup. Um, basically, I put the disk in boot from the Windows disk, and then it starts running through its its startup process. Right. That's where it, it stops. It gives me the error. Someone's uh, people are saying it's a corrupt hard drive. Corrupt hard drive. That's what some people are suggesting. Windows disk is scratched. Update the Mobo drivers. Disk is scratched. Quick erase it. That's corrupt okay. hard drive. Sounds like it. Okay, well, so. here's, here's what else I've come up with. Um, I tried installing Vista just to see what would happen. Um, got a similar error code, so I actually jumped back to mo your favorite, Millennium Edition. Oh. Millennium, Millennium Edition installed perfectly. It runs perfect. The problem is, is dude, your computer's possessed. No, 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 dude, dude. It, so. Your computer's possessed. It's possessed. Because any computer that could run <laughs> Millennium Edition fine and not XP is possessed. <laughs> I agree. I agree. Try doing a. I, I, someone recommended a, a, a D band, Derek Boot and Nuke, uh, and uh, okay. try that. See what happens. You might consider picking up a. I mean, if it really matters to you, uh, a copy of Spinrite from Steve Gibson, just to scan the disk for any kind of errors. Uh, you know, obviously running through a check disk will you know pick up any bad sectors and, and flag them to never be written over again. Um, I mean, yeah, I, I wouldn't abandon everything completely, but I would definitely, do, yeah, I'd deban the disk. Make sure it's all, like, just nothing's on there at all. Because I've had issues where I've installed, I, everything was running fine. I installed Vista, and then everything got screwed up. And then I tried rolling back, and then things were just wonky from that point forward because Vista did something to um, to the drive. Try a deban. Okay. Try going that way. Try going that route and try, uh, try going at it again that way. Okay, so stuff can survive a... a, a partition, deletion, and all that. It's so, possible. I didn't know that. It's possible. Uh, okay. You know, it, you know, I'm not saying that it's likely, but, you know, stranger things have happened. If you can put Millennium Edition on that computer and it works fine, uh, uh, you're an anomaly, dude. <laughs> right on. I agree. All right. So, all right. Thanks, Chris. We'll talk to you later. Yeah, bye. Bye.